But like defunding the police, I don't know. I'm of two minds about that. Because on the one hand, you could say, wow, it sounds so radical. Like people who say, I'm a Marxist, I'm a socialist. Why do you have to say that? People say, well, you know, you know, AOC, why do you have to say you're a socialist? Just say you're for people having health care. Everybody agrees with that. You know, like, like, it's really funny. You ask a European, you ask somebody from Germany, like, what do you think of the far left party? you know, the far left of the Democratic Party in the United States. And they say, well, that's pretty much a middle right winger here in Germany. You know, that's, yeah. you know what? what? What do you mean? Like, it's a controversy that people shouldn't die because they don't have health care. That's that's controversial. So, I mean, I hear what you're saying about defund that like, if you say defund people think anarchy in the streets like a movie. Um, but in reality, you know, I thought that AOC had a pretty good answer. She said, you know what defunding the police looks like? And if you're thinking about it, if you're white and living in a suburban or exurban middle-class neighborhood, it looks like your neighborhood. Yeah. You get some police every so often. They come, they actually come when you call them for a call, but they're not always there asking you where you're going. Uh, when you look at when you look at the litigation that stopped many of the stop and frisk programs in New York City, um, mm -hmm. that, you know, we're reaching fever pitch around right. 2013, 2014, uh, or 2011, I think is when they reached the fever pitch around 2011. And then 2013, 14, they started going down and now they're really down 98%. If you look at the way that the police commissioner, Raymond Kelly justified that stop and frisk program, he didn't say, oh, we're catching tons of criminals because they weren't. Uh, only uh, like 94% of them didn't lead to any form of arrest and 98% of them, there was no weapon found. Um, what he said was, I tell my police to go out there, right? Because we need to show these young black men who's in control on the street. So they know every time when they go out, they think about us, the police. Okay. That's <laughs> the social control that, that was at the heart of that program. A teachable moment, huh? <laughs>